Hello, everybody. Today, in today's video, because, you know, I can't do a lot of race room recently because it's difficult to do. We're going to talk about various different types. Very many. Probably didn't even see that when I was close to the camera. Hi. Types of blades. Various blades. That is the title of today's video. In case you haven't already noticed, which is probably the first thing you noticed when you clicked on this video. So you should have noticed. Please, tell me you noticed. Please. 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 Anyways. Ooh, look, there's another one here. I am going to go through all these blades with you. We're going to discuss their various aspects and stuff. Also, computer. And, um, yes. Did I zoom? No, I didn't. Just making sure. So, blade number one. This. Let's bring it under light. The Micro Leatherman. It's a beautiful little knife. It's my father's knife, actually. Um, I'll sit you down right here. It opens up like this. And it's little scissors. Snip, snip. Show me your snips, brother. <laughs> Does this thing focus? A stupid camera. At least it doesn't have the background hum. There's various other blades within, like, um, there's this blade as well. And, yeah, so... There was also typical other stuff you might find in like something like that. This knife here, a Swiss Army. So, anyways, the next knife. So, this next knife is going to take a quick second to get completely and fully open. Tis the Leatherman. This is pretty much all the Leatherman is really. It's, um,. It's a knife. It has my initials on it. R A R, Roman Rodriguez. So um, and it has the Boy Scout symbol and typical Swiss Army badging. So yeah, it's it's a Swiss Army knife with the other stuff over there. Now we're gonna put it all back together. Here, I like doing this. Alright, so that is another knife out of the way. We got two down and more to go. We're gonna go with this one. The one in the box. Pop the box open. Boom. It's open. Open that up. Boom, it's a knife. This one. <laughs> this one. My friends, is my very first knife ever. It was given to me by my grandfather when I was at the age of one. Why he gave it to me? So I could use it later in life. That says grandson's first knife on it. But he gave it to me then, just because why not? It has one knife there. It's hard to do this with one hand. And then there's this knife as well. It's the second knife in there. This is not going to focus at all. But this says to... Let's try zooming. Lord, it doesn't make it any better. Oh, you can see that. Yes, it says R-A-R. -R. That's the important part. That is my initial. You get again, Roman... Rodriguez. Of course, I'm going to bleep out my middle name. So, yeah, that's that knife, and it comes in this very special box. 11-25-2007. Hard to read. And 12-25. Okay, I'm going insane. That is another knife down. Next knife, this little black one. It's beautiful. 
I bought it in New Mexico. It's a Shrade. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. I featured this shortly in my other video, but now we're going to demonstrate more fully that you can just flick it right open. Shrade. Right there. You see it? Shrade. Very, very nice knife. It doesn't, it's not spring loaded, see, so yeah, it's not spring loaded, so you just gotta go, oh, crap, I messed up. <laughs> like that, you gotta, whoosh, 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 whoosh. You really gotta give it some force. So that's a nice knife, you can clip it on, you see there's a clip, and it's black, and as you can see, it looks like it's been all beat up. It came like that originally, which is really cool if you ask me. It, it's a real, that one's a really cool knife. Now for the top two, which is that big one. But this one, which is more fun in my opinion, it's red. I have no clue what brand it is. Um, it has a clip on it as well. It has a really weird triangle texture that is interesting to look at. It's more red than the camera shows. But um, this one is spring powered. <laughs> it's so... Because when, when I came back from the break, right, I was busy using this knife in during the break and so I was used to having to eat it so then when I came home I picked this up off my table I was like whoa scared the crap out of me because it has so much force when it opens too I don't know if you can tell but it opens on a dime and now for the last but not least the ginormous knife I have stories of how I got all these knives really quick before we get to the big one. This is my dad's. He got it from a friend from college. This one's mine. I got it for Christmas. This one's also mine. I bought it in New Mexico at a knife shore, sh sh store. This one I bought in Colorado. It has no brand. And this I got for Christmas. Now, for the big granddaddy of all the knives the bear gm mc mcg it's a bear that's a, that's all i know is it says bear i got this one from let me move this I should have oh, crap it almost fell off the table nobody saw that nobody nobody, nobody saw that we're fine have i been covering up the microphone this entire time i swear to god i'll have to watch the footage and make sure i didn't cover up the microphone anyways i don't know why i didn't move the table earlier this knife I got from my sister's boyfriend, <laughs> which is kind of a strange story, and it's my favorite knife. It's got this nice leather sheath on it, and you just unbutton it, I need two hands. You just unbutton it, and it's right open, slide the sheath off, and it's double sided, it has a little hilt, it says Bear MGC USA. It has this cool looking handle with like burnt streaks of wood into it. It's really flashing on the camera. Let's see if I can blind you. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Um so that this is like my favorite knife. In fact, you can't tell anybody this, but there's a little hole in my bed over there because of that. Nobody saw that. We're gonna completely ignore the fact that it What am I doing? Anyways, thank you for watching today's video. That what was the point of the ceiling? That was various knives by Roman Rudd. The stupid microphone. I'll have to watch this video and make sure I'm not covering up the microphone too much. So thank you all for watching. And uh there's the ceiling again for you. And we'll see you again in the next video in Okay, whatever. See you all later.